MGAS or monoclonal gammopathy of undetermined significance is a precursor or the stage before myeloma happens. And it's actually a very common disease or entity before in many, many of us as we get older. In fact, maybe 5% of the population over the age of 50 would have this early MGUS. What is early MGUS? The condition of MGUS does not usually impact a person's health or result in any symptoms. MGUS is most often found on a routine blood test that notes a high level of protein in the blood and additional tests show the protein is a monoclonal antibody. So MGUS, or monoclonal gammopathy of unknown significance, is um, a precursor to typically to smoldering myeloma and then to multiple myeloma. Not all MGUS is going to um, progress to multiple myeloma. In fact, usually does not. Also important to have a hematologist on board if you are diagnosed with MGUS. There is a study being done right now in Iceland called the iStop MM study or the black swan study, um, where they are looking at every resident over a certain age um, to detect how many people in the general population have MGUS and they follow them over time longitudinally to see how many of those patients who have MGUS will progress to smoldering myeloma and then onto multiple myeloma. So it's really interesting. I guess what I would say about MGUS, if you're diagnosed with MGUS, not to panic. You have a lot of time to think about it, to have a hematologist follow you and typically MGUS as far as I know, it's not treated. It is just monitored to see if it will progress onto smoldering myeloma and then onto multiple myeloma.